Hello everyone, how are you doing? Yesterday I was on a call, on a coaching call with one of my favorite students and she was talking about that she was experiencing a lot of overwhelm. So she has work, she has tons of work piling up and there's all sort of chaos going on and at 9.30 a.m. in the morning she was going through a ton of overwhelm and frustration you know the whole thing so we had a great coaching call and I want to share with you that if you are experiencing overwhelm in your life right then what it is about how do you handle it if you are experiencing overwhelm for any reason it could be work related it could be relationship related it could be due to anything right overwhelm essentially happens because we get off center that's it that's it that is you see overwhelm is an experience it's a certain experience of a certain level of disharmony within our state of being and it happens when we slowly 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 come out of our center and that is when we experience overwhelm now what happens usually when we are experiencing overwhelm we tend to project it outwards that okay this is happening because of my work it is happening because of this person or this group of people or you know because you know of this 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 in the outer external reality of mind if all these things get taken care of overwhelm will not be present in a sense that is true on one level but the essential higher level of looking at things is always or, or the way the wizard looks at things you know I talk about wizard consciousness the way of the wizard is to not look at reflection and take feedback from that in a sense and see why the reflection has been caused in the first place that is I always say that in the wizard consciousness we see experiences as reflection right and the reflection is about what vibrational state of being we are in it just reflects that back right so if you are experiencing overwhelm overwhelm is not about the work if overwhelm is not about the thing you know you feel like that the reflection is causing you to feel what you are feeling but rather it is you who has created the experience before you okay i know i know it might sound a little bit counterintuitive but that is how it is in wizard consciousness so now we understand that everything is a reflection of our state of being and it is us who has calibrated who have calibrated into a certain state of being which we are now experiencing as overwhelm okay now this is what i want to give to you that you know when you're in the midst of overwhelm and when you have all the reasons and justification and logic you know to project it outwards and say this is what it is about I want to give you the, this clarity that even if you are on a beach okay beautiful sea sunshine you know no work you are on a holiday you can still create the experience of overwhelm right then and there if you choose to come off your center see if the reason you experience peace and bliss and all the good feelings it's not because of the place it's because when you are in a certain place, sometimes you choose to give yourself the permission. You choose to allow yourself to come back to your center. And when you come back to your center, that is when you experience the peace. That is when you experience all the good feelings, right? Sometimes when we meditate on our own in our own room, that is when we come back to our center and we experience the same peace, bliss, good feelings and the whole, whole thing right and that's just what I want to give to you that overwhelm or relaxation or harmony or peace or all the good stuff is not about the outside situation okay <laughs> nothing is about the outside situation in visit consciousness everything is just a reflection of your state of being so when you are experiencing overwhelm let's say if you are experiencing overwhelm or if you find yourself in a place sometime where you're experiencing overwhelm this is what i want you to do number one number one thing that you do is recognize it is only happening because you are off center you cannot deny yourself when you're experiencing overwhelm that you are off center that is the truth okay you can tell that you know it's happening because of somebody else that's not the point 
the point is you are off center it is your responsibility because nobody can put you back to your center <laughs> right so take responsibility understand that it is my state of being i am responsible for my state of being this is my world i am responsible for the reflection that i'm reflect thing back through my external reality i am the creator i am the wizard so what i'm going to do is i am going to prioritize i am going to prioritize to prioritize being in my center okay and what i'm going to do is i'm going to find time i'm going to create time maybe it's 5 minutes you know in the midst of overwhelm it is very hard to sometimes to find time i understand but i am going to make choices that is going to create a difference because if you do not take choices make choices that is going to shift your vibrational state of being you are not going to change any thing in your external reality if you do not change things inside you don't change nothing outside right so once you prioritize it is what you do that is you find time 5 minutes to meditate 5 minutes to center yourself 5 minutes to ground 5 minutes to relax you know a simple relaxation grounding meditation something that brings back to your center is going to help you tons and if you find yourself that you have tons of stuff to do that you needs your attention immediately you cannot but not do them you but you do not have time to allow yourself for active meditation and centering fantastic no need to worry because there's something that you can do which is called active centering that is as you are going about your work as you are doing the things that requires your attention what you start doing is basically you constantly tell yourself that as i do the things i will notice myself contract because overwhelm or any disharmony contracts our state of being right when our state of being contract the energy is not able to move through you know smoothly and that is when we experience all sort of negative emotions right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to do the work that needs to be done i'm going to pay attention to all the things that needs to be taken care of whatever that is okay but i'm going to constantly and consistently come back to my center actively on a moment to moment basis as i go about it i will notice that i am coming off center i will notice i'll have attention to my state of being as i go about things as i notice that i'm contracting at that moment i'm going to tell myself this relax 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 the moment i you start using this mantra this affirmation relax my state of being immediately decontracts the relaxation is a powerful powerful tool you know relaxation is the opposite of contraction when you tell yourself relax you decontract so when you are working when you are doing the things let's say you approach it a minute by minute if there's a lot of overwhelm going on you can tell yourself this like after every 5 minute or after every 1 minute or after every 2 minute you know whenever i feel comfortable i'm going to take a little break and i'm going to come back to my center i'm going to start relaxing i'm going to take a break and i'm going to start relaxing i'm going to start relaxing i'll just come back to my center i'll decontract and i'll approach again i'll decontract and i'll approach again and that is how you go about doing the things that needs to be taken care of and yet constantly use it as a platform to come back to your center it becomes a centering active back active centering practice right the same work that was now overwhelming you the same things that was overwhelming you becomes a catalyst for you to grow and expand and see how much centered you can become you evolve through the challenges that sometimes appear before you because it's the very purpose of that experience okay and always always find some time 5 minutes 10 minutes you know maximum you know if you want to do it more fantastic 5 minutes at least throughout your day whenever you feel that you are a little comfortable sit down relax meditate and come back to your center that's your inner sanctuary right a simple relaxation meditation i have a relaxation meditation in my channel you can ask me for it and you can use that meditation to come back to your center the sim it, it's very simple what you do is sit down and you start breathing and you start telling yourself relax like a mantra relax 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 for the entire 5 minutes you know 
with a clear intention that every utterance of the word relaxation you will decontract you will decompress you will let go of the thoughts you will allow yourself to become more relaxed and you'll start getting back to your center five minutes if you do it you'll see the experience of overwhelm is going away and the thing is when you come back to your center your vibration rises when your vibration rises you will have so much clarity to do the things in the best possible way, right? The things that needs to be taken care of, you will be able to approach it in the best possible way. It will become like an adventure. It will not feel like an overwhelming craziness, you know? It will start appearing like an adventure. Then it will start appearing like a game. Then it will start appearing like fun. Then it will become all into flow and everything will settle down. See, all that happens is when we are overwhelmed, we cannot have access to clarity. We cannot have access to our best abilities because they are in a certain different vibrational vicinity. When we center, the energy starts flowing automatically. Your vibration rises and slowly you have now access to clarity, to wisdom, to understanding, to move into things, to maneuver through your work or whatever that needs to be done effortlessly and it, it starts appearing fun the whole experience changes right this is wizard consciousness <laughs> right so i hope you have enjoyed i hope you make use of it right and at the moment i'm in the process of building a one month program co-creating with students who are going to be joining i am taking students for this new program which i call the wizard initiation program a one month program, four weeks of, you know, live sessions as well as video module courses and group sessions with me where I'm going to be teaching you, introducing to those of you who want to get introduced into Wizard Stage of Consciousness, those of you who resonate with what I teach, who feel that they are ready, if you feel you are ready for living your life magically from this Wizard Stage of Consciousness where we use the law of reflection, law of creation which is law of attraction in translated in 4D reality to manifest our dream life, right? We live magically by paying attention to our inner guidance system. If you want to learn all about this, if you want to participate in this program, I'm taking students and those of you who are going to join now at this point of time when this video is getting created, you are going to get a huge discount because you will help me co-create the program, right? And once the program is solidified and built and ready, after the first set of student, the price will not remain the same. It will go up, right? So you're going to get a huge discount. At the moment, you can get it at around $200, okay, for the whole thing, okay? But this is like only for now, okay? Depending on when you're watching the video, right? It might or might not be available, right? So if you want to know about the program, if you want to work with me directly, send me a mail my mail id will be in the description of the video or send me a direct message if you're watching this on facebook or elsewhere i'll get in touch with you i'll ask you some questions i'll have a chat with you and if i feel that you are ready for this i will have a discovery call and a spiritual integration session with you and i'll introduce to you about the program and if i feel that you will benefit from the program at the moment i will offer you to join to be on board with this program and we'll, we'll begin this journey right so i hope you have enjoyed have fun give a like to this video subscribe to this channel if you have not already share it with your friends and i'll see you again soon